So hey guys, um, today I went to Target and I got the BrainBot 3000. This looked like a pretty cool figure. I'm not gonna lie. Um, so I picked him up. Uh, one that I'm really, um, I'm really trying to look for is the Bad Banana. I'm pretty sure like if y'all like Roblox and y'all seen it at Target, y'all probably have bought it. So let's just, so I was about to open it, but then I was like, hey, I can make a video on this. And I'm gonna do the code, I guess. So I'm not gonna do it like on camera. Can't have to do it with my phone. And I'm not gonna do it with my computer because I do not have a computer. Okay, so here's the back, the little card. And look at that. Straight off. So I think it's only like an axe and like a metal detector. Okay, so we got our little thing. Let's see who's on here. Oh, I want Operation Scorpion the Savior. What I might. T is cool. Look, after the flash. Look. Look at him. And then. I already got the Gem Enchanter. Um, T is really cool. Right there. It's like a little T. Oh, after the flash, Crusher Mutant looks cool. Darken more, Edwin. He's cool. Bad banana in the core packs. Okay, there's Brainbot 3000. Um, there's the Pirates Tale of Shark People and the Cube Clash. Okay, so I'm gonna redeem my Artem code after this. Artem. Here's the little thingy that you can put the item code on. Scratch that off after I finish this video. I just dropped it. Okay, so let's get this out. I don't want to break them because I know like sometimes the Roblox toys can be a little bit fragile. I had one of mine break. I wasn't really that sad. It was kind of an old figure. There's his little metal detector. Here's this cool little hammer axe thing. Here is the Brainbot 3000. I think Roblox made up this character by themselves. So um, let's put in this little metal detector. Wait, can you even put it in? Does it fit? Let's see if it fits. I think it will because it has this little armrest thingy. Let's try it in this other hand. Might work better. There. So he has this little metal detector. How come it's not going off? Like, I'm not sure if it's going off because it doesn't make any noises. But yeah, he's a really cool figure. And I'm gonna take out my hard work, if I can, there. And replace it with this cool hammer thing. He has this little thing, it looks like, you know, um, at Target, whenever I uh, did the scanny thing, you know when you scan it yourself, like the little receipt pops out, that's what it looks like. It looks like a receipt. Or maybe that's just how he talks. This character is really cool. It even has some detail right here. His little armrest. And let's look at this little axe thing. I think it's just a hammer. So let's look at this hammer. It's really cool. It like has these two silver things and it has a spike at the back. So we can like turn it around and kill someone, I guess. Okay. This is the little box he comes in. 
Um, this is the last one at Target, and um, the only ones they had left were like the celebrities or whatever they are, the new ones, you know, like the noob attack. No, I think I picked up the last noob attack. I didn't do a review on it though. And then there's only like the crystal little thing, and then um, the oof, the skater one. And you can make him match these parts. He has no head movement. His knees can't go that far though. Knees can only extend. Uh, or, oh wait, no. Okay. So that's my little review on um, Brainbot 3000, I think. Let me get the little checklist. Yeah, Brainbot 3000. He's a really nice figure. Hopefully. Y'all didn't mind dogs barking, and peace out. See you guys later.